Welcome to the iPad Apps First Look channel. This is a review of a game called Dark Manor, a hidden object mystery by Big Fish Games. Big Fish, well known name in the uh, game for computers, PCs, iOS devices, and uh, Android. Um, it's a free game with, of course, in app purchases. So, um, at least you can play. Um, if you want to go faster, of course, you will do in-app purchases. But a lot of the, um, actually the game itself, from what I've seen yet, is uh, pretty much playable even if you don't have or don't buy any uh, purchases, buy coins and stuff. Um, but it's going to take you, of course, a little bit longer because you won't have as many ints and stuff. It's a nice game, and uh, I reviewed this game in this week of uh, the upcoming Halloween in a, a couple of weeks. So uh, this week is really Halloween-themed games and apps. Free of charge, uh, Dark Matter by Big Fish Games, and uh, it's a um, 35 megabyte file. It's not too big, and it's uh, basically a hidden object game with a uh, Spooky team works on iOS 5 or better devices, so iPhone 4, 4S, 5, 5C, 5S, iPad 2, um, iPad 2 and up, basically. Um, also on iPod Touch, fifth generation, and of course, it's optimized for. The iPhone 5, it has in-app purchases of gold stuff, so chest of gold, bucket of gold, vault of gold, and so on, up to a $99 mountain of gold if you want. So uh, these apps can really, really become expensive if you're not careful. Once it's installed, it really is a quite a nice game, Dark Matter, giving you from Big Fish Games uh, a very, very cool it an object game. If you like that style of gaming, um, I think it's cool. Now on an iPhone and iPod Touch, it might be a little small. Here it's cool because I airplay my device to my TV, so it brings it much bigger and easier to actually play. But uh, I would see this game more on an iPad than on a small device. Yet with my iPhone 5 and a Retina display, it's still playable, so um, but you'll have to look more carefully. As you see here, really, really nice Halloween or ghost feel to it. And so here we go. It's, of course, a hidden object so you click on the objects that are on the bottom of your screen so here a map a rose and a trumpet so let's take a rose um, map and so let's look at the trumpet right here and here we go and you have ints, but to get ints, you'll have to get coins, of course. And here you go. And as you go on, you have different... spooky spots on the uh, town or the map where you're going. So, uh, you, of course, you've got to free these uh, ghosts. So now you can uh, go and complete, for example, the gypsy puzzle. And it goes on and on and on, and it's uh, nice. The feel of the game, the graphics of the game, everything is very beautiful in this uh, game. And um, I really, really, really like it. If you like it in objects, I think this is a jewel of a game for iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. And of course, if you have AirPlay 
possibilities then it's really nice because you can display it like I'm doing now on a full HD TV which uh, is even better and makes the game even more fun and so you just bump up the volume a little bit and um, you get really into this spooky atmosphere uh, while you're playing so if you enjoy our app reviews uh, please subscribe to our channel give us thumbs up and uh, if you have an app of your own maybe you have a feature of iOS you'd like us to make a video and talk about let us know and um, even if it's a paid app we have a budget every week that we will uh, actually pay for apps and this and actually review them so that you can see them before you have to um, buy them and uh, hope you enjoy our videos and that you'll come back to the iPad apps first look channel bye bye